Good morning. Hello, sunshine. Come with me. Beat. That is a uh, no. That is a uh, that's yeah. That's Mandisa featuring Toby Mac. That's he. I was that's looking for a good fun. morning song, and a lot of the good morning songs were not appropriate. Had the nope. <laughs> I was like, I'm not doing that. What if you played the clean version? No, because as I found out before. Y'all know the dirt. Y'all know the not clean version, and y'all just sing right over it. So, they know the dirty versions. Oh. Uh, I know, right? I, I'm shocked. I'm shocked. So, good yeah. Thursday morning, everybody. We are flipping to these. Are actually now morning announcements. We are, they, we start your day. Good morning. It's Ooh, Buddha, Buddha. wake up. Day. Wake up. Wake up, sleepy heads. Wake up. We're here with you. Right here with you. And this one a few times. This one a few times. We were so busy yesterday and Wednesday. This has been a few times. We've actually. Had Film these announcements in the morning. It is it's like it's eight seventeen in the morning. morning. Friday Eve in the morning. It is. Morning. Oh, it is Friday Eve. Hashtag Friday Eve. And two more days till Thanksgiving break. Yes. Can't wait. Hashtag Can't stuffing today. Or dressing. It's stuffing if it's in the bird. It's dressing if it's on the side. Correct. Is that? Is that one? Um, I just call it stuffing, regardless. I always I call it dressing. It, I call it dressing. So it's dressing. I think if you put it in the bird, it's stuffing. If you put it out of the bird, it's dressing. But I don't know if people will do the in the bird anymore because they do so many exotic that's things. Why we call it stuffing because it was always in the bird. But it's <laughs> I think they, you put it in afterwards. But isn't it called stove it's talk? Dressing. Thank you for talking. Thank you for the morning announcements. Turkey talk this morning. Uh, I think <laughs> that you, hotline. you can deep fry. I heard I heard on the radio today on the, on the way in that uh, you could actually they sell now these air fryers for turkeys. They must be huge. Like eighty bucks, but they must be massive because you know you barely get like a small chicken in the air fryer. But mm -hmm. ladies and gentlemen, pizza pockets in, or pizza rolls in an air fryer, phenomenal, amazing. I put them in the microwave. I've never had that. Treat, your, treat, microwave yourself, treat yourself better oh, yeah. than microwaving your pizza rolls. Yeah, it That's takes seven tip. minutes. Seven minutes, and it's perfect. That's a little tip. Don't microwave your pizza rolls. Put them in the oven or put them in the Oven makes me crispy harder. Air fryer. Yeah, put in the air fryer. Don't, don't, no, don't, don't do the whole microwave is good if you like them soggy. But who likes yeah. soggy food? It's like the meat and the lunchables. We pulled it back, soggy and gross. So, all right. We promised our teachers we will not go too long. So, we'll get into announcements. But thank you for doing turkey talk with your administrators. All right, today is Thursday, November the 9th, Friday Eve. Friday Eve. Before th the first, the last Friday Eve before Thanksgiving, and then next week's Friday Eve is actually Thanksgiving. Yes. So, all right. right. We're a week away. Uh, remember, we're celebrating veterans uh, all the way. As, as you keep sending them to us, we'll keep celebrating the veterans today. we got a couple of sixth graders, Jayla Albright, in the sixth grade, her grandfather, Daniel Albright, and her uncle, Josh Falconer, were veterans. Awesome. And then uh, Charlie Harriman in the sixth grade had an uncle, and it is a perfect name for a, I believe he flew airplanes is what Charlie told me, Buzz Harriman. Mm -hmm. uh, so that, you know, that is a guy who is, that's a guy who's flying planes. The name cool. Buzz or your, yeah, no, all, all Buzz, I think, had to be in the military or yeah. had to be flying something. So, you know, he was a cool guy. Thank you. Thank you, Charlie and Jayla. Nice. All right, students, you're starting your day at Canvas. Of course, you're seeing us through Canvas. You better be. How's it going? Canvas. <laughs> How are you? Hey. Hi. I'm now on Canvas. MSDWT.instructure.com. And then parents, you're starting at WesleyanParents.com. And students, too, if you want to see a schedule, you can do that. We don't have anything top secret on the Wesleyan Parent Portal. So if you wanted to go there ever, you could. It doesn't explode or doesn't have any kind of security settings that you couldn't uh, get on there and look at some See what's going videos on. or I got to take the videos down now because now we're just operating under uh, virtual but when we come back I mean if we come back later rather than sooner we might have some new spaces to show you but other than that we'll just come back pretty much the same space we were all right um Mr. Allen please show us how to be responsible on zoom how to be responsible on zoom first guys please log in five minutes early before class starts so we can be prepared and ready to work be sure that your device is charged and ready to go. Use the restroom, eat all your snacks before class starts, and ask questions if you don't understand something. All right, be safe, be responsible, be respectful on Zoom. 
If you have any technical issues, please call 317-254-5566. That's the help desk for Washington Township. Mm -hmm. We have two birthdays today. Two uh, birthdays. Jacqueline Antunez Aguiar. Birthday, Jacqueline. Birthday, Jackie. Jacqueline. And Jordan Terry, our boy Jordan. Hey, Jordan. Seventh grader, Jordan birthday, Terry. Jordan. Happy birthday, birthday is coming up. No, that's awesome. All right, so today for Thursday, November the 19th, uh, here's our schedule. We are having advisory, 9, 10 to 9, 50. We have expanded all advisories to 40 minutes, but we're not doing the Wacky Wednesday longer advisory. It takes, a, it, we collect that time across the week. Ms. Barbara, tell us about today's schedule. Okay, today on our amazing blue day, period, period one will be 10 to 11, 15. You'll have 10 minutes to get to period two, which really shouldn't take you long because you're on your couch. From period two, 11.25 to 12.40. Lunch, so you can go get those toasty Totino's pizza rolls. Yes, and do not microwave them. <laughs> From 12.40 to 1.10. Period three will start at 1.15 to 2.30, and then you'll finish your day in period four from 2.40 to 4.00. And tomorrow is the same schedule, 9, 10, and 9, 50 advisory. And then we have the periods and uh, we'll read these off uh, for tomorrow's announcements, but yeah. just make sure you kind of get used to this time. Your parents have seen it. You've seen it. I think your teachers are putting up on canvas. Write it down. So, and then I starting when we come back on uh, Monday, we'll start doing some things at four o'clock for um, with small groups for your advisory classes. Mm -hmm. And your teachers will explain more about that when you're going to come in and when you're invited to come in. Uh, we're going to have about, we're going to split your advisories into about four equal parts. And then people will meet Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. So Friday will be your time after four o'clock because the teachers will be sending out progress reports for all students who are not doing as well as they could be uh, in the classes. So mm -hmm. cool. we are going to be contacting you for NWA makeups today. Mr. Allen's spearheading that, but I, I'm sure Ms. Barbara and I will be uh, helping uh, do that. So if you get contacted, we will talk to your teacher about Maybe you're not in class because we need to make, get you to make up these reading and math NWEA tests because like, tomorrow's our last day to do these. All right, the mission of Westland Middle School is to develop lifelong learners and globally minded citizens by fostering the academic, creative, and social skills needed to achieve excellence in a multicultural environment. Every wildcat, every day gets better. All right, so I've been told, and I know you guys have sports, so no, 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 here we go. The academic team, sixth grade, is already 2-0. They, they, uh, they won last week against Lincoln, total blowout. They won last night against the hated New Augusta Phoenix and their assistant yes. principal, Mr. Bishop, yes. who, being by one. And I don't know. Okay, so and I'm just going to say this now. Win. Miss, <laughs> Miss, <laughs> Mrs. Patzel and Mr. Brewer, I need to get me. If you guys won too, just let me know, and I'll, we'll put it on Fridays. But basketball, how do we do the other night against Guy and Creek? Guy and Creek, wow. So the seventh okay. grade. Go ahead, seventh grade. Go ahead. Go no, ahead. no, no. Okay, well, I was there. I was so excited. Go right here. Go right ahead. You will do eighth grade. Seventh grade, I'm telling you what, boys. I'm so proud of them. And Coach Baker is holding you so accountable for paying attention. Mm -hmm. You came up a little short against Guy and Creek, but you guys did amazing. And you stay with it. You listen to your coach. And next time you see Guy and Creek, it, the win is yours. Eighth grade with Mr. Allen. All right, eighth grade. Of those who are listening, no cap at all. No cap at all. Eighth grade did awesome. Amazing. They led the, most of the entire game. They was up almost 20-something points. Guy and Creek tried to come back, but they failed to do so. Eighth grade came home with the win. Keep it up. They got a game tonight. It'll be on Instagram. Make sure you're watching it against my old school I used to work at. We're going we're gonna to beat them. Chapel Hill. Come and get some. You're not ready for us. We are, they may be, we are Wayne, but we are the winners and we are West Lane. Oh, exactly. <laughs> Got to pull that in. Nice. So, ladies and gentlemen, have a great first day of, of uh, back to virtual learning uh, with your teachers live. And I'm sure they are excited to see your faces after yesterday's asynchronous day. So have a great day and have a great morning. Bye. See ya.